So today I got two emails from an old company, Circuit City. This company went out of business a long time ago, back in the early thousands. And it was one of my first ever hauls. Obviously I didn't record it because I was in high school and that kind of stuff. And phones back then still had the flip thing. They had cameras, but they weren't uh, video cameras. And But anyways, Circuit City is doing what people will be uh, should expecting uh, Jeffrey's Toy Box or Toys R Us is doing. They're going to be stores within stores, but they're also going to... Uh, they're trying to come back, obviously, because you, know, you don't want to go bankrupt. And they have their own web, their websites up and running now. That's what the emails were. And they're advertisements for the store. And I know the one that was in uh, the Mall of America was the last one to actually close. That one was actually featured <clears throat> in the movie Eagle Eye in the uh, scene where they go into the TVs and talk all about how the uh, Shia LaBeouf's character is basically the dumb one of the twins and they personally wants him because of his face. And his brother was better. Jerry, that's his name. But, uh... Yeah, Circuit City's coming back. And that we should probably and if you're looking into Jeffrey's toy box uh, or Toys R Us, that's probably what you're going to uh get. So this would be a good uh look into how Jeffrey's toy box is probably gonna work. One second while I go get the emails. Here you can see I've got I actually read one, but I've gotten a lot of emails from Circuit City in the last couple days. Here's the first one, the weekly special. And yeah, website's up, running, they're selling TVs, tablets, speakers, computers. I don't know why you want to order like a TV through the mail. I mean, I know Amazon sells and some people buy that, but... And in a press release a while back when this was actually announced a couple months ago, they said that they'd be doing the uh, try to put some stores within stores, like just have a little kiosk area of the stores and that kind of stuff. Let's look at their actual website. Free shipping on $35 or more. It's kind of like a uh, BuzzFeed Tumblr thing with the stories on and that kind of stuff. But they also still sell things. Come on, you piece of junk. Products. <laughs> Lost, that's funny. Old TV. It's probably an old photo still sticking around. Although Ponyo is new, because that wasn't released in America back when uh, Circuit City closed. You yeah, don't really have any like uh, great value on these. They're like normal. They're like normal prices. Some of them are high prices, like forty nine dollars for the last season loss. That's a little too high. But yeah, Circus City's alive. They're not well, obviously. And 
and have a good one. And you can actually see they're calling themselves an e-commerce website. Now. This is their uh, Facebook. Although it does say retail company now as well. Yeah, when I said a long time ago, this was back in January. It's actually the day, day after my birthday, January 9th. But, uh, yeah, see stores on the horizon. Relaunched February 19th. The story was uh, January 9th. Once bankrupt retailer. Two thousand and eight, yeah, but last year high school. That's when they that's when they closed. Yep, see? On Monday, Shomol, that's the person who owns the thing, told publishers major retailers have expressed interest in working with Circuit City to open stores within their stores, just like Jeffrey's Toy Box. Best Buy, Amazon, Target, and Walmart. Those might be the ones that will get Circuit City. And might buy something that's Circuit City branded just as a nostalgic thing. But other than that, I mean... It holds nostalgia for me. It's like what some people have for Blockbuster. I mean, I also have it for Blockbuster, but well, some people have been having for Toys R Us. So, but well, unlike Toys R Us, Circuit City's keeping their name. So yeah, Circuit City was a. Uh, this is actually going to let people see how Jeffrey's Toy Box might work. A little look into the future. Now have a good one.